And for those who enjoy this channel and would love to support us financially, please feel free to hit that donate link. We greatly appreciate it. God bless. Okay. Today I'm going to talk about just five of the over 1,000 fine-tuning evidence that we have discovered in the entire universe. Just five out of 1,000. Some related to the Earth. Okay? Now, let's start with this. This is our Milky Way galaxy. And that is the Sun. Okay? Did you know that our Sun's orbit around our galaxy is circular? Okay? As compared to other stars, which do not orbit circular. Okay? A little deviation, just a little of our orbit towards the sun would be chaotic and we would likely drift towards the edge of our galaxy where radiation levels are high okay so it has to be circular it must not be elliptical or not perfectly circular Okay, now, next image. Our galaxy and other galaxy has the bulge. Okay, and this bulge must also be perfect or designed in order to sustain life. Okay, this bulge, if it is too large, okay, just like other galaxies, which have a smaller bulge okay or a larger bulge much too larger a planet any planet will be blasted by deadly radiation so our planet has a bulge that is fine-tuned to sustain our planet to sustain life okay now the next image, this is uh, one of God's, well, billions of galaxies. This is really beautiful and a problem for evolutionists because uh, they cannot explain how a galaxy is formed. They could theorize and guess, but that's it. Okay? And look at this picture. It looks like there's a sun at the middle of the galaxy. Hmm? It looks designed. And look at what surrounds the sun like. It's nearly perfectly circular. That surrounds the sun like. Awesome. There are many other samples of this. Or these types of galaxies which evolutionists absolutely cannot explain. Now, next picture are the uh, four gas giants of our uh, solar system Uranus, Uranus, Neptune, Neptune, Jupiter, and Saturn and look at these planets, their orbits they are unique and almost circular orbits a random created or evolutionary a random uh, neb their, their nebular theory it would not have created or likely have not created such perfect circular orbits and look at this it really looks designed look at how perfect it is okay and as we know or maybe you don't know these gas giants also provides proof 
that help stabilize the inner planets where our planet Earth is located. If these planets do not exist, okay, which helps stabilize the solar system through gravity, okay, by making Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars stable, which are the smaller planets, then we would be sucked into the sun. Okay, so thank God for these gas giants. Okay, now uh, I said I'm going to provide only uh, 5 out of 1,000. So uh, this is the last one. This is what we call the local group. And as you can see, that is our galaxy. As you can see, our local group contains only a small amount of galaxies. Other galaxy clusters, other galaxy groups, are condensed or have a lot of galaxies. Okay, our galaxy cluster is smaller, as you can see, it is not dense, it is not dense. Its spacing is very good. Okay, if uh, it were more dense, a tug of war of gravity would make it okay, uh, lifeless or would make it unfit for life. Okay, and like I said, or maybe I haven't said it. The vast majority of galaxies in this cosmos reside in a dense cluster. And you can even see it when you look at galaxy clusters. Many galaxies in our universe are also uh, less dense. Okay? Less dense. Just like our local group. But most of them are not well spaced or okay it will not it will create a gravitational tug of war okay because uh, they are in a dense galaxy cluster okay this goes to show how unique our small galaxy cluster is and this is evidence of design for all those who appreciate the work that we're doing here on standing for truth please hit that subscribe button because we are just getting started